Hey everyone, welcome and thank you for joining us for another great video here on Chuckwagon MTG. Today we're kicking off February's uh, Patreon packs. So we got a big old stack of cards here, plus we have the uh, newly refurbished build a pack box uh, that we're going to be pulling cards out of. We actually have a beta card in the box now. Tell me it's not awesome. And it's not mixed in with the commons and uncommons. It's with the uh, commas worth a buck or more. So the chance of getting it is actually much, much higher. So uh, without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into this. Uh, who do we have up first? First off, we have Adam Brody. Adam, thank you so much for being a patron. It is greatly appreciated. You help us do the things that we do. Um, real quick, I do want to give another reminder. I'm going to be giving a ton of these um, that... Um, Essentially, we are going to be canceling almost all of our Patreon tiers uh, this month. Uh, so, unfortunately, you guys are going to have to re-sign up. Um, we have to adjust prices. Um, this is hopefully something we only have to do once uh, and not for a quite a long time. Uh, or it, if we do have to change it, hopefully it's not for quite some time. Um, but so we're because you can't change the actual tiers... Um, you have to uh, delete them uh, and then add the new price to the the newly created tier. So uh, please, everyone, keep that in mind. Uh, hopefully, uh, you're you're patient with us and re-sign on uh, when we cancel all that stuff. So, anyways, uh, without further ado, let's go ahead and get Adam's packs. He's got four packs here. He is in the director's board tier for twenty bucks a month. He gets his four packs of the current standard. And then we build him a pack out of the build a pack box. He gets two rares, not one. He gets two. Every build a pack gets two rares. He doesn't get a common or uncommon worth at least a buck. A random foil and a random foil basic that we just replenished with some really good stuff. <clears throat> Excuse me. And then we're going to get ten cards out of here. Uh, these cards span Magic's history. Um, Mostly commons and uncommons, but there's a few rares and a few foils mixed in. There's also prize cards where you can win extra packs, extra foils, extra rares. Two, three, four, and five. All right. Let's see what we got for Adam. We got a Charging Rhino, uh, Marasa Ranger. Uh, we got a Kroll Stinger, you're playing green blue, I think. Uh, you got Yarox Wave Crasher, you've got Ferivore, uh, Luminous Bonds, Kaldatha Rebirth. This was one of my favorite decks. If you haven't, if you've never seen uh, Opal Goblins, um, look up that deck. It was a, a tier one deck uh, during standard at the time. Absolutely amazing deck. One of my favorites. Uh, we got Minotaur Abomination. We've got Mob and then a Dwarven Lightsmith. All right. Your foil basic is a Theros Mountain. Your random foil is a... Oh, you got a rare, too. A uh, Tromocratus. Love that Kraken stuff. And Krakens are kind of doing some cool stuff now, so that's not bad. Your random rare is a reflect, or not rare, uh, common on common worthy is a buck, is a reflector mage. I'm almost positive he's still over a buck. If not, we'll go ahead and swap it out for you. All right, your first rare is, oh, clifftop retreat. Lands are never bad. Never bad. So nice. All right, with your second rare being a folio of fancies. All right. Well, congrats on the build pack box pack. Let's see what you got in your packs. Now, as I'm throwing stuff everywhere. All right, we got... Okay, so this is a regular pack. See, not all of them are flipped upside down. <laughs> all right, uh, we've got an Acolyte of Affliction. Uh, Escape Velocity, Hateful Eidolon, and then... Oh, look at that. You got a Arasta, the Endless Web. And I believe there's a foil, too. Foil uh, or... Oreed of Mountain's Blaze. Okay. Good stuff there. Oh, what am I doing? What am I doing? What am I doing? I, I don't know. I don't know. Stuff's happening. I like the spider, though. I really do. 
Um, I honestly thought I'd see a lot more play with it. Um, and especially considering that control decks are, at least on Arena, are kind of starting to take over. Alright, we got one with the stars, Siona, Underworld Fires, and an Ashiox Erasure. Good stuff. That's a, that's an annoying an annoying spell. <laughs> All right, and I bumped the mic. Sorry, folks. Let's see what we got here. We got a Dawn Evangel, Furious Rise, Madoma, Madomais, Madomais, Prophecy, and then a Temple of Malice with a foil, Nyx. Harold, not too bad, not too bad. I, I'm, I'm glad they decided to finish the whole cycle of temples. I mean, I kind of knew they would once we saw the uh, the 20s come out, but still, it's it's nice to know. Uh, we got Scaphos Maze Warden, uh, Wolf Willow Haven, and Underworld. Dreams followed by a Temple of Deceit. Two temples. Interesting. All right, well, there you go, Adam. Um, I honestly don't know if we got there. I really don't know if we did. Um, well, hopefully we did. Either way, thank you so much for being a patron. It's greatly appreciated. Let's just do all the fun stuff that, uh, that we do and... Uh, yeah, and we, believe it or not, we do have some rather big goals for the channel. Um, it's just getting through the day-to-day -day that seems to chew up a lot of our time. But anyways, who do we have next? Next up, we have none other than Golden Bohunsky. Golden, thank you so much for being a patron. Greatly appreciate it. Are these different colors? These are. I just noticed that. Uh, oh, you, well, you can't see them on the camera that well. Uh, yeah, I can't find an angle where you can see it well, but here in person, you can tell 100% this color is like, this pack is like almost like an entirely different shade of blue. Blue, green, aqua, whatever that is, but, oh, anyways, hopefully that's some good luck. Let's go ahead and grab his build pack pack for him. One, two, got one of those, one of those, one of those, and we'll do one two, three. We'll grab the very last card. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. All right. Let's see what we got for Golden today. We need a prize card to come up soon is what we need because we haven't seen a prize card in like two or three months. All right, here we go. We got a Light Walker. We got Planet. We got Unholy Indenture. We got Price of Betrayal. Uh, Dwarven Priest. Trusted Pegasus. Oh, you got a, a random rare. We got a Brood Butcher. Go ahead and put that up there. We got a uh, Regathen Firecat. I think that's how it's done. Pronounced. Yeah. Uh, Iron Shell Beetle. And then Mirak Nightblade. All right, let's see. Your foil basic is ta da! Oh, another Theros Mountain. All right, random foil is a foul renewal. This one actually just got added to the box. Another nice little foil rare. Your uncommon is, or common or uncommon, is Mystical Dispute. Yeah, that's still up there. All right, your first rare is you get a Naya Soul Beast, some uh, Commander goodie stuff right there and then you've got a zatulpa primal dawn i love that dino man was that fun and standard all right well good luck or no, congratulations on the pack good luck on these packs let's see what we can't get for you all right let's see we got a fenelex tactics uh dream stalker manticore favored 
of Iros, and then, hey, first mythic, Calyx, Destiny's Hand. Good stuff. Well, not bad at all, sir. All right, we got, oh, nope, 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 nope. What are you doing, Chuck? Bad, bad, naughty. Okay, there we go. I don't know what happened. I don't know. Okay, so those, okay. You see, the, the packs being flipped around has confused me yet again. Because, like, I don't know, the first box, box and a half, I don't know, maybe the first two boxes were all, were, you know, they were opposite of this, backwards. So, all right. Now we know what we're doing. That goes there. All right, we got a Banishing Light, we've got a Nessian Horn Beetle, we've got a Commanding Presence, and then Archon of Sun's Grace. Next pack. Oh, I think we got a foil. I think we may have gotten a foil. All right, we got... I'll seed, I'll side of life's bounty. I don't know how that's pronounced. Someone please correct me in the comments. Uh, we got Furious Right. We got, or Furious Rise. I always call it Furious Right for some reason. We got Thundering Chariot. And then a Heliod's Intervention. Followed by a Foil. Oh, nice. A Foil Island. Good stuff there. All right, let's see what this last pack holds for Mr. Bohunsky. Wait. Oh, my goodness. Okay, so... <laughs> yeah, like like mid-open... Oh, sorry, rare. All right. Man, it's doing its best. To trip me up here. <laughs> we got a rise to glory. Uh, drag to the underworld. And Arleos. Uh, enraptured. With your rare being. Ooh. Hactos the unscarred. This card has been kind of the bane of my existence. And it always seems to land on four for me. When I'm playing those I, I've got more than a few decks that, like, they top out at three. So I literally have nothing in the deck that can touch this card. Oh, man. All right, well, good pulls, good stuff. Get yourself a foil island and a mythic. Go ahead and grab your name tag. Put it right there. And then who do we have up next? We have Mr. Jonathan Vogelson. Jonathan, thank you so much for being a patron it is greatly appreciated these packs look the same you know what now that, that that makes sense that last pack looked a little bit different now nah, okay yeah <laughs> all right well let's thank you jonathan for being a patron uh i got myself sidetracked there let's go ahead and build your pack here uh let's see we got one rare we got two common or uncommon Foil and foil basic. And then one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. It's always harder to grab cards when we flat freshly refill the box because like everything's in there so tight all right let's see what we got for jonathan uh we're starting off old we got a oh back in center we got a foul presence uh we got a steady progress academy raider uh got a knight of the tusk get an oxida oxidia oxida scrap melter sure uh get oh another random rare uh ojitai soul of winter got a nixborn marauder uh, Loam Larva, Revitalize, and Armored Kingcrix. Alright. Let's see what we got here for Foil Basic is... Uh, what is that? Shadows? I think it's Shadows over in Estrad. 
uh, planes. All right. Random foil is uh, Advocate of the Beast. I had fun with that one. I'm a big fan. All right. You're common or uncommon. Uh, you get yourself a Mind Stone from uh, Iconic. Your first rare is... Or oh, Mythic. You got Omnath, Locus of the Royal. That's not a bad little hit. Followed by... Nylia's Intervention. I'm a fan of this card. I really am. Um, it, it seems EDH-ish, but I think that's standard playable. I could be wrong, which is probably why you know, I build the decks that I do. But, anywho, congrats on uh, your Build-A-Pack box pack. Why am I having so much trouble opening a pack of cards? My goodness. Alright, so, okay. Now we're back to Okay, rare. <laughs> All right. Let's see what we got. Oh, what happened here? What? What? I grabbed too many cards. Son of a biscuit. I'm sorry. I just completely spoiled it all. All right. Well, real quick. Arcana of Falling Stars, Meyer Triton, and the thing I can't pronounce. Followed by... Uh, your uh, Nylia, Keen-Eyed, another mythic, not too shabby, with a foil Omen of the Hunt. Oish, that was painful. Well, congrats on the hit. Alright, so we got that, we got that rare, one, two, three. That should be, okay, good stuff. All right, we got a Devourer of Memory, Hero of the Nyxborn, and Favorite of Iroas, followed by a uh, Galia of the End Endless Dance. Get a Seder Lord, people. I've seen a couple decks. No. Okay, yeah, okay. I know what we're doing, I swear. I've seen a couple decks that run it, and it doesn't look bad. It really doesn't. No foil. Uh, Nessian Wanderer, Daxos, and uh, Madomi's or Madomai's Prophecy. With your rare being, Elspeth's Elspeth Conquers Death. This is not a bad card. That's a nice little hit. Um, I don't know where it's at money wise. Um, I really haven't been paying much attention to the prices uh, since they started dropping like hard, hard. I just kind of looked away um but that one seems good to me oh i am so sorry folks I sneezed right near there okay so then this okay Ugh. all right let's see we got a mischievous chimera or shimmera depending on how you want to pronounce it it's chimera um, we've got, uh, Fraka Spawn, and then we've got a Mirror Shield. With your rare being, a Temple of Enlightenment. That's three temples. All right, well, congrats on your pulls. I don't think you did too bad between this and then your Omnath. Yep, that's good stuff right there. All right. Congrats, congrats. Oh, do I have another one coming on? I'm sorry, folks. I guess it's probably considered kind of rude to like sneeze in your ear. <laughs> All right, who do we have up next? Next up, we have Mr. Arthur Isikar. Arthur, thank you so much for being a patron. Greatly appreciated. Um, and, you know, I'm not sure if y'all have ever heard me talk about doing Commander Cube on here, uh, but Arthur is the one that owns the Commander Cube we play out of. Holy cats. Holy cats. Holy cats. It's nuts. So nuts. Uh, anyways, he is in the investor's tier. This one is only 10 bucks a month. Two packs of standard, and then we build them a pack out of here. Which, by the way, if you want to check out our Patreon, see what kind of good stuff we offer, keep in mind we're changing prices. They're not going up by much, but they are going up. Um, uh, check out the description down below. You can see... Uh, what we have to offer. Oh, another thing I want you guys to check out. There is a new site that we're trying. 
Uh, it's called uh, the MTG Card Stand. Uh, it's a selling platform. Uh, if you go down in the description, down in the link, you'll find a link to our stand. Now, we only have about 800 cards up right now, uh, and they're, it's all smaller stuff, from 25 cents to, I think, like 10 bucks. Um, and I'm not saying you have to go even buy stuff, but if you could just go check it out, let me know what you think about the user interface. Uh, how easy is it to get a hold of me? Now, how easy is it to initiate uh, a purchase? Um, you know, I just, I just, I want some feedback on the site because it looks like it could be good to me, but I just want to make sure it's something that you guys would actually like. So, anyways, I lost my count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, we're at ten on the money. Sweet. All right, let's see what we got for Arter. Got a Beloved Princess, got a Seer's Lantern, Unwind, Pacifism, uh, Ceruli Caretaker, we got a Deep Freeze, we've got a Duress, we've got a Gaia Skyfolk, uh, Blade Tribe Berserkers, and another Duress. We don't do doubles. So we're going to put that card back, and then you're going to get uh, a Lash of Thorns. Yeah, we don't do doubles. I mean, if you really want the double, we can throw it in, but... Yeah. Anyways, your foil basic is going to be an M20 Mountain. We got all that awesome old foil, old art, old borderlands, and we keep pulling all newer stuff. <laughs> all right, your random basic, or your random foil is uh, a virulent swipe from Iconic Masters. Your common or uncommon is a Dream's Grip. Your first rare is uh, Argul's Bloodfast. I like that card too. And then your second rare is a... Oh, you got the, uh, the promo pack, Feasting Troll King. All right, not too shabby. Congratulations on that stuff. Let's see what you got in your packs. Do, 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 do. Oh, that means there's a foil. And we're not going to spoil it this time, I promise. All right, what do we got here? Oh, we got a constellation, uh, Renata, called to the hunt. Uh, Fateful End, and then Whirlwind, Denial. With your rare being, or mythic, Perforos, Bronze Blooded. That's good stuff. We're pulling some good mythics today. With your foil being an Underworld Ragehound. You can play your foil with your, with your Perforos. All right, on to pack number two. All right. We got a uh, Shimmering Chimera. Got an Inevitable End and a Dawn Evangel. With your rare being another Ashiox Erasure. All right, good stuff. I don't think you did too bad. I think we did good. Mythics are always good. Good name tag here. Throw it on the front. Put it on the stack. All right. Yeah, Archer, thank you so much for being a patron. I really enjoy. I mean, so I mean, I'm sh I'm sure. A lot of co all content creators are, are gonna thank their creators, but I just I'm really thankful for you people. It's you've been just such so good to me, so good. I'm, I'm happy. I'm a happy guy. <laughs> Who do we have next? Next up, we have Sona. Sona, thank you so much for being a patron. That's one pack. Uh, same thing. Two packs, and then build a pack. Hopefully we start seeing some good hits collect. Okay, no, the, the Omnath, that was a good hit. I say, I want to see some good hits with the new cards, but yeah, Omnath is not shabby. Four, five, we got six, seven, eight. Nine and one more for ten. Let's see what we got for Sona this time around. We got a Reckless Airstrike, uh, a Duress. There must be a pocket of them. A grim Contest. We've got Scuttlemutt, 
We've got Retributive Wand, Daggerback Basculus, uh, Warden of the Chained, Shimmer Scale Drake, Raging Red Cap, and a Rod of Ruin. All right, let's see what your foil basic is. It's an Amonkhet Swamp. Tell you what, though, that looks... One second here, folks. So you can't see it that well in the camera, but this is one of the, and I know it was kind of common in this set, but this is one of those exceptionally dark swamps. Good stuff. Good stuff. I didn't even notice that when I was putting it in there. All right, let's see what your foil, random foil is. It is a uh, fairy miscreant. Okay. Common or uncommon. Get yourself eternal witness. Pretty sure it's still up there. Uh, let's see what you got for a your first rare. It is going to be a Ripjaw Raptor. Another not-so-bad one. And then a Serum Powder. One of the new cards that just went in. Well, congrats on your Build-A-Pack box pack. I don't think you did too shabby. Let's see what we can do with your packs. No foil. All right. You get... Oh. This card in Limited is just bonkers, broken, ridiculous. Ew. Ew. It gets bigger and it gets to fly. R&D, come on. We got uh, Utropia, the twice favored. Uh, Blood Aspirant and then Soul Guide Lantern. With your rare being. Ooh, Erberos Intervention. I'm digging this. I think this one's going places. That's it is. It gives you, especially with all the graveyard interaction right now. That's just that's a winner winner. All right, one, two, three. Oh man, I was hoping for foil. All right, there's a Nyx Herald, uh, cling to dust, and the binding of the Titans. With your rare being, Dryad of the Elysian Grove. Let's actually get that first. All right, well, congrats on your polls. We'll get your name tag here. Thank you so much for being a patron, helping us do what we do. All right, what do we got up next? Uh, oh, we've got one more. We have Today we have got Eric Birch. Eric, thank you so much for being a patron. Is greatly appreciated. Same thing, two packs. And then we got one rare. We got two. Common or uncommon. Grab a random foil. We'll get a random foil basic. And then we'll do one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine and ten. Real quick, something else I would really like if y'all could help me out on. Um, the the camera angle, or more so the camera distance for viewing the cards. Um, we've had some people suggest that they would like to see the cards closer. Um, but in doing that, you can't see us pull out of the Build-A-Pack box that well. The reason we had the camera backed up in the first place, you could see us pull out of the box, was essentially to um, ensure the integrity uh, of the Build-A-Pack box to know that we're not, you know, pulling out of something off the side or whatever. But uh, I want to know what you think. Would you rather see the box of us actually pulling stuff out, or do you enjoy the closer view of the cards? But with the closer view, let's go ahead and see what we've got here. We've got a fan favorite. We've got a Spear Spewer, uh, Netcaster Spider, got an Angelic Wall, uh, Revoke Privileges. There's an Enhanced Surveillance. A Veldekin Ceratark or Keratark? Ceratarch? Sure. There is a renowned weaponsmith, a phantasmal form, and inquisitive puppet. Alright, let's see. Your foil basic is an M19 Island. Followed up by Ooh, a foil desperate ritual. That's not a bad little hit. 
Congrats on that. All right, your foil basic is uh, Mirrored Landscape. Okay, yeah, that's a thing. Followed by your first rare, which is a Sarah Ascendant. Wow, okay. We're doing some good stuff here. <laughs> your next rare is Sun Petal Grove. Man, we're going to call that winner, winner, chicken dinner. Nice, nice build-a-pack box pack. In fact, I, I think your build-a-pack might outdo your actual packs. All right. Let's see, got that, got that, that, and there's a foil to boot. All right. Uh, we got a Fateful End, a Laguna Band Storyteller, and then Enemy of Enlightenment, with your rare being... Woe Strider. Good stuff right here. I, I'm a fan of this card. I'm currently actually, uh, I'm running a deck. Um, that, that, that's an all-star. It really is. All right, let's see your foil is. It is a, uh, Elite Instructor. All right, pack number two. No foil in this one. All right, we got a Destiny Spinner, got a Mischievous Chimera, and a Sage of Mysteries. With your rare being... Oh, look at that! You got yourself a Constellation, Kythos, God of Destiny. Man. I'm happy. I'm happy, y'all. I'm so sorry. Why don't you go? I just snuck up out of nowhere. Yeah, congrats, Eric. This has been... Oh, we had that rough month, but things have been turning around. All right. Now, what do we have up next? Next, we have uh, our weekly giveaway, which, uh, as you can see from last uh, last one we did, uh, was done on a Sunday. So, kind of an intermittent, like... Sorry, we forgot. Well, we didn't forget. It just, it didn't work itself into the deck tech video. So, but anyways, uh, this little contest, the only thing you have to do to get into this is, uh, you have to comment on the videos and you have to be subscribed to the channel. When you comment, we go through and every time we make one of these videos, we pull all the comments from the last, uh, week or two weeks, depending on the number of videos and etc cetera, etc cetera. Uh, but then we put your name on this wheel here the wheel of decide or you could call it the wheel of fortune uh but your name is on here we're going to run over to random.org we're going to roll two six-sided dice whatever number comes up that's how many times we're going to click the wheel to spin it uh we've got 11 so it's going to be spinning for a second uh good luck to everybody that's involved we got once twice thrice Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and eleven. Congratulations to Daniel Wiseman. Daniel, congratulations. Getting a pack of the new Theros. All right, we'll go ahead and roll the cameras back over, and uh, we'll go ahead and open Daniel's pack right now. So Daniel actually just got some cards uh, like a month or so ago from us. Some good cards, I do believe. All right. All right. No foil. What do we got? We got a Warden of the Chained. We've got an Annex Hardened in the Forge and a Dawn Evangel. Your rare is... Ooh, a Bronze Hide Lion. Good stuff right there. All right, now don't forget, you do have to contact us within 30 days to claim your prize. If you don't, at the 30-day mark, we go ahead and we take it out of the sleeve that I'm about to put it in, and we insert it directly into the Patreon Build-A-Pack box. Let me write your name down here, if this pen will work. Okay, that is a bad pen. We're going to throw that away. I mean, it wrote, but... It's not good. All right, so we'll take this. We'll grab you a sleeve. 
All right. Don't worry, it is not lightly played. That just happens to be the sleeve that I grabbed. All right. Well, I think that's about it. Next week, we'll be doing uh, another uh, another Patreon video. Um, I know it makes them kind of long when we cram all the video or all the patrons into uh, two weeks. Uh, but we wanted to do uh, last month. It was because of Theros being released. This month, we wanted all the new cards to be able to make it into the build a pack box before we start doing that uh, or start doing this. So. Uh, that's about it. Uh, please do us a huge favor. Go down in the description and check out our links. Um, we've got links to everything, our Facebook page, our Twitter, um, any of the deck techs we've ever run on here. Uh, we've got a link to our tapped out page that has the deck lists for every deck we've ever done on the channel. Well, I think, um, I think every deck we've ever done on the channel. Um, and then I think there might even be a couple that we just made that were just like, hey, it's kind of cool. But anyways, uh, check it out. You can check out our uh, MTG stand. That link is down there as well, as well as our Patreon, uh, MTG Strategists, uh, his uh, uh, blog. I mean, the, the whole nine yard. You can find everything you need down in the description of this video. Uh, I want to thank everyone for watching. If you like what you saw here today, do us a huge favor. Please click the like button, hit subscribe. The bell, notif bell notification button so you can tell we'll come out with new stuff. And then share this with your friends, your family, your loved ones, and your pets. Everyone could use a little more magic in their lives. Once again, thank you so much for watching. And as always, you can find us on all the social medias, Chuckwagon MTG.